to answer my the question. It's a simple question, just a, just a date. Just a it date. was on, on July the, the 19th or 20th, around so there. July nineteenth or twentieth, so uh, even even longer than was originally a uh, uh, you know a full month before uh, before your department uh, took any action. Justin Trudeau calls Canadians racists while funding one himself. Hi, I'm Brian Lilly, political columnist for the Toronto Sun. We've all heard how many times Justin Trudeau has called Canadians he doesn't agree with or who don't agree with him racists, misogynists, all those wonderful things. <laughs> Conservative Party members can stand with people who wave swastikas. They can stand with people who wave uh, the Confederate flag. Well, turns out he not only was funding someone with horrible views about blacks, about Jews, about um, Indigenous Canadians, about Francophones. He was not only funding them, his office knew. This is the story of Laith Maroof. We told you about it back in August when news broke that the government had given this guy and his organization, the Community Media Advocacy Center, $133,000 to teach people how not to be racist. And yet he'd made comments about all the groups I just mentioned that I can't repeat here and can't print in the paper either. So this is the guy that Trudeau, his government, decided to fund. His organization is some a group that never should have been got, getting government contracts or government money, but it took the government a week to drop this after it became public. A little while later, we found out that the minister in charge, Ahmed Hussein, that he knew about it back in July, a month earlier. And now the latest news confirmed by the Globe and Mail is that Trudeau's office knew as well. The PMO knew. They're not denying it. They've confirmed it. But they didn't do anything for a month. You know that you are funding a guy to do anti-racism training who has said horrific things and you don't do anything until the public pressure mounts. Justin Trudeau can never get on his high horse again and denounce anyone for anything. That, well, at least he shouldn't. But you know that he will because the man has no self-awareness. He has no shame. And he's going to keep putting forward and projecting his worst attributes onto other people. He will declare anyone who disagrees with him racist while ignoring the fact that he and his government were funding one. They knew it and they didn't act. That's the worst part. They didn't act. Let me know what you think on this one. Drop a comment down below, share this on social media, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.